Hey guys, so we're gonna show you the PPP, portable power pulley. So it's basically a pulley system, um, but you could really bring it around wherever you want because it uses the suction cups here, as you can see. Um, so yeah, you could, it's very versatile. I would suggest using this for like high reps, slow tempo. Because there's only three levels of resistance for this machine, for someone like me, I would do high reps and slow controlled movements. Um, but if you're a beginner, this could be perfect for you as the high resistance might be hard enough for you. All right, so I'm gonna show you how to use this. Um, we're gonna use the wall this time. So I'm just gonna put it up against. Make sure you press against the door, right? Apply pressure that way. And then use this to suck out all the air. So you can see it's slowly flattening out. So now that's flat. So let's assume there's not enough air or there's no air in there. Enough air that it holds that, you know, suck, if that's the right word. It needs to suck. Now we'll do the other side. Again, I'll show you. Since we're doing it against the wall, we're gonna press towards the wall that way and Pump it, pump the air out until you lose, you don't see the white part here. And the thingamajiggy, there, that's a better word. All right, so now we have it about my height. So I'm gonna show you a few exercises that you can do with a PPP. Let's go. First exercise is the chest fly. So super simple. Obviously, this resistance too light for me. I just try that out. So what we can do is, come check this out. Just press here to adjust. So that's a third position, I did it three times. Same thing for the other side here. There you go. And the thing about, I like this is it feels like free weights, because see, it can adjust wherever you take it. All right, so it doesn't really feel like a machine. I'm all about free weights. So now, that feels better. The resistance did increase. So that, there you have it, chest flies. Next would be chest press. So the difference would be bending at the elbows more, all right. If chest flies was too hard, this is something easier. You can also switch to the stance of your legs. I'm just pushing down. Nice and controlled. If you want more of a workout and you're not used to slower movements, you can definitely slow it down. Nice and controlled. There you have it. Two chest exercises. Next, we're gonna do is reverse fly. So this is really great for um, improving your posture, especially for the guys out there that do a lot of chest exercises. It kind of pulls your shoulders in. So this is one great way to reverse that movement or that posture. So this improves your posture. So here we go. Make sure you hold it like so. Right arm on the left, right, left arm on the right machine or pulley, sorry. And just pull it back as far as you can, holding for one second. Slow and nice and controlled. Again, pull back, nice and controlled. So this is where we do high reps, slow and controlled movements. Now we're gonna switch it up. So we're still about, you know, my height, but we're gonna bring that two together. Look at this, how I just easily take it out by pressing this thingy here. And pressing it there. There you go. Now we're gonna do um, pullovers. Taking your butt back, chest out, pull. All right, from there, we're gonna switch it up to tricep extensions, all right, so, or tricep kickbacks. Down it out. Clip your elbows by your ribs and bend your knees ever so slightly to lower your center of gravity. Push down, nice and controlled. I feel it's slightly different. You can take a step back even more. Hold for a second, nice and controlled. All right, there you go. All right guys, so I hope you like those exercises. Make sure you get your PPP today. You can see it's super versatile. Um, it's great if you don't have a lot of space at home, you don't want to put a lot of heavy weights. This will be perfect. All you really need is a good surface that will make sure that it sticks and sucks real good. So if you like to suck, get this.